Commitment is a key principle for pursuing your goals. Whatever your hustle, committed action towards it is important for success. Commitment keeps you going to the success you desire. My name is Catherine Gaho and I'm in the business of research and training. And one of the things that I've been doing in the last few weeks is to do the series on success tips. I have now done up to success tip number six and today we are going to look at success tip number seven. You know they say success is complicated. So it takes not just one thing but many bits and pieces which when done together is what will help you accomplish the success you desire. So let's now go ahead and look at commitment. Commitment is a key success principle. Success carries different meanings for different people. Whatever your hustle, commit to keep at it. After deciding what success means to you, the next thing that you have to do is to commit 110% to taking the actions necessary to achieve it. Whatever you want, commitment is key to getting it. Regardless of your definition of success, you need to commit to your hustle. For some, it may be starting your own business, for others, it's moving to the next level in your career. Yet for others, it could be providing your family with a befitting standard of living. Whatever it is, you need to define it for yourself. And once you've done that and created your own meaning of success, then you need to work with commitment towards accomplishing it. The word hustle or hustler has many meanings. I use it here in an inspirational context to mean working hard with great energy and drive you know pushing your agenda and continuing to push forward regardless of the challenges that you experience along the way to quote abraham lincoln good things come to those who wait but only what is left by those who hustle of course, you know that it's common for us to say that good things come to those who wait. But Abraham Lincoln said it differently. He said, good things come to those who wait, but only what is left by those who hustle. Commitment is the willingness to direct your energy, your time, your effort, your network and resources to what you want to accomplish. It's the readiness to work hard, work smart, and keep working to keep the promises that you have made to yourself. Commitment goes far beyond desire. Many times we all say that, oh, I want this, I want that, I want to go to this level and all that. But it takes more than that. While desire is important, many with strong desires or even very clearly defined goals fail the accomplishment test. And this is because we do not commit to doing what we must do to get to where we want to go. It was Vince Robardi who said that most people fail not because of lack of desire, but because of lack of commitment. Without commitment, you will not get started. Without commitment, you will not have the energy to do it even when it's not convenient. Commitment is not the same as interest. You can be interested in something but still not work at it with dedication and diligence. It was Ken Branchard, the author of The One Minute Manager, who explained the difference between interest and commitment in a fascinating way. He said that when you are interested in doing something, you will do it only when it's convenient. But when you are committed to something, you accept no excuses. Only results. Meaning that you apply yourself and your skills and your abilities fully until your goal is accomplished. You just do it. You keep doing it until you get to where you want to go. Commitment is evidence by action. If you are committed, you will do what is required even if it's hard. You will do it even if it's challenging. If you are committed, you will do it even if it's not convenient. You will do it even if it's not exciting. If you are committed, you will upgrade your skills. You will take the time to learn whatever you need to learn in order to achieve your goals. If you are committed, 
you will not give excuses. If you are committed, you will not waste time on detractors and haters. You will develop a plan on how to achieve your goals. If you are committed, you will change your habits and your routines. You will rise up early and keep focused in the pursuit of your goals. That's commitment. Let me suggest three ways to keep you inspired and committed to your hustle. One, press on. Once you commit to a goal, you should press on and keep moving and pressing towards it. Keep pushing forward by taking all the necessary actions to achieve the goal, regardless of the challenges you encounter or the limits in resources. Committed people will press on towards their goal until it's accomplished. They don't listen to naysayers, detractors, and haters. As the 44th president of the U.S., Barack Obama said, the future rewards those who press on. So just press on. Second, be diligent. This means that you need to work hard and carefully to pursue your goal. As a diligent worker, you handle the tasks before you extremely well. You tend to work to do difficult things well. You deliver to a high standard. You push forward and stay the course. You work in a tireless manner or complete task after task in order to accomplish the goal that you're committed to. Diligence is an important skill that speaks of the ability to concentrate and focus on completing the required tasks. Diligent people are both quality and time conscious. They believe in the motto, forward ever, backward never. Number three, be enthusiastic. To have great commitment towards something, you need to be enthusiastic about it. Enthusiastic people bring positive energy and joy to a project. They pursue something with great you know, joy and gladness which inspires others and it enables them to pursue it with strength, determination, and passion. Enthusiasm makes a difference between doing something for the sake of it and doing it to the best of your ability. It supports you to strive for excellence. To sum it up, the three ways to keep you inspired and committed to your hustle are one, press on. Two, be diligent. Three, be enthusiastic. I have a question for you. What one action will you take in the next few days to demonstrate your commitment? Thank you for watching. If you're new here, remember to subscribe and comment. Thank you and best wishes. Keep watching. We all need to elevate our mindset at this time. <laughs>